Good morning, Covenant kids. Welcome to another episode of Jorigami, where Joe is going to teach us how to make something out of paper. What are you teaching us how to make today, Joe? So today we're going to make a origami bunny. All right, a bunny for Easter. You can fill your house with them. We need to start, as uh, usual, with a square piece of paper. So you can take any piece of paper you have and make it square. Um, and then, Joe, guide us. What are we doing today? So first thing you want to do is fold the paper in half. All right, halfway. Then you open it up and fold this bottom edge, this middle crease. Okay, so one third up. For those who like fractions. Then you do the same on the other side. Okay. So the two outsides come in to make it a half. Half sheet size. Then the next thing you want to do is fold it this bottom edge so it runs along this middle line. So the corner gets folded in to the middle there. Yes. Okay. Do the same thing on the other side. Oh, right. It's like when I was making paper airplanes. And you're a peat on the other side. Okay, so we have all four, all four corners get folded in. Yes. Awesome. So you get a shape somewhat like this, and you open it up. Okay. Fold it in half. Like with this part in, okay? Yeah. Then once you've done that, press it down, then open it back up. And fold this edge to the middle crease. Okay, so kind of like we start folding the bottom to the middle. You do the same thing on the other side. Okay, and all this folding, and we have a square. Then you open it back up, and you open that fold <laughs> that you just did back up. Okay. And this one's quite tricky. You push this corner down to the middle, and it should just fold so you, down to a triangle. So you pop that fold you did before, kind of pop it backwards, and then you get that corner down to the middle. Yes, okay. and you do it on the other side too. You do it on the bottom. Okay. Great. Then you repeat on the other side. <laughs> All right. This shape. So the next thing you want to do is take, flip it over. Okay. Take this corner, fold up to the middle, so okay. these flaps can pop out. Oh, okay. So the and bottom corner to the middle, but these pop out. Okay. Then you do the same thing on the other side. All right. Now you have the same shape, but the flaps, flaps on the end. On the end. Okay. Then you flip it over. All right. And fold this corner. Fold like this, running along from that corner down to the middle crease where it meets perpendicular. Nope. To the okay. A little bit of a tricky fold too. Yes. 
Gotta make sure you hold the one end in place, I think. Okay. Then flip it over again. So this will just did our in the yes. back, okay. And you'll sort of start to see a bunny bunny's face and legs shaping. So there will be two corn two corner things there. Yes. You'll fold the line across there like this. So the nose or the point will pop out. Okay. So it should look something like this. Then, you're going to fold this edge to this edge. So you're just folding it in half? Yeah, is that what just it is? folding it in half. Okay. Then, go this out like a few centimeters maybe. So not quite, not, so it's not quite a squared off thing? Not quite squared off. And then you fold it? Then you crease it down, yeah. Crease it down, okay. So the next thing you want to do is fold this dot corner under so it will poke out right how long you want your feet to be. Before you want okay, to so this is going to be on a bit of an angle. So, yeah, it's a And then they small, poke out like feet. That's like what you're saying, a right? Few centimeters. Poke out like feet. Then okay. you unfold it. Open up the bottom, just a bit, and push these bottom, this back, flat things in, and they should poke out. Like so you're just kind of turning inside out what you just folded outside? Yes. Okay. And you basically have your bunny, but, you, but we can fold but flatter, just fold it back how far you want it to be. Not that far, like a centimeter ish. Okay. Open up the bottom of it and do the same thing that we just did. Just tuck, tuck it inside. Tuck it in, and you have your bunny. I think mine kind of worked. Full disclosure this is our second take. My first one wasn't very good. But you have a chance to go back and watch this. We're going to post this on YouTube by itself so you can go back and watch and learn and make some bunnies for yourself. I hope this was fun for you guys. Thanks so much, Joe, for helping us out. You're welcome. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.